What are you saying everyone, ADR here, back with another foot draft challenge. Today we are going for the 128. As you can hear in my voice, apologies, I'm a bit ill, bear with me. Um, it started off with a 90 rated Hadji, which isn't too bad. As you know, Serie A team of the season has been released. So we're hopefully going to pick up some of the Serie A cards, which should make it easier to get those high rated drafts, especially the 128. Leave a like if you enjoy the content, subscribe to the channel if you're not subscribed already. And it's been an okay start to the draft. We do need to see some more icons and obviously 97 rated players is the way to get that 95 rated draft. But at the moment, we are struggling for rating just a little bit. Um, Hopefully we get some big centre backs to save it and e. Do I take this Rudiger? I guess we do. It means we can't get his higher rated version. Take Vivian here, gets the La Liga links, which is nice. And our last centre back will need replacing. We'll take Fabian Shaw for now. In goal, can we get a big goalkeeper? We get Donnarumma. So not a great start, if we're being honest. A lot better though as we get 94 rated Mary Earps. Maybe should have taken the Petr Cech there. Just because we don't have many icons as it is. But I'm sure we can pick up a few in the team uh, from the bench, from the reserves. We get Reese James. Not really what we want to see. Come on. Give us big players now. Do you get an icon here in Eusebio? Which is okay plus three to the chemistry need a new center back and a new left mid most noticeably we get klaus he can play right mid so a bit of an upgrade there gets the french link with diani as well which is nice we also get kafu so kafu can go right mid plus three to the chemistry again could do with one more icon get a middle start here not really what we want to see last chance at a high rated attacker we pick up 97 rated Lionel Messi, first 97 of the draft. I'm going to play him in at cam. I'll move Hadji to left to mid. Um, next up, can we get another big player? We get Florian Wurtz, not the highest rated of players. And wow, this is a bad draft. This, this draft is quite bad, if we're being honest. We'll take Williamson here, plus four to the chemistry, which is nice. But yeah, this draft, this is probably one of the worst drafts I've seen. If we order up the bench, no doubt we got to a 9-2, but not a great start to the draft. We'll take our manager and we'll move swiftly on to the next draft attempt. So into the next draft attempt, we are going to take the 3-4-2-1 formation. Loads of high rated attackers and wow. It's an interesting choice of captain picks. You don't usually see this. Um, I'm going to take Ronaldinho. I know he's got a high rated card, but a 93 rated left mid that is an icon is a very nice start to the draft. We'll take, I mean, Vitinha and Dunst have high rated cards. We'll take Sergio Oliveira here. And alongside him, we get 94 rated Abelai. So tempted to take the Mateus, but we are going to take Abelai. Right mid, Carolyn Nicoli has a new card, which is, I think, 94 rated or 95 rated. Um, so we'll take we'll take Jones. I don't think Jones has any high rated cards. Hopefully we get the big centre forwards. Uh, not really. We get 91 rated Rude Hullet. Can we see a 97? Oh, we don't see 97, Cruyff, but we will settle for his 95 version. There's so many 97 rated strikers here as well. Um, and obviously we don't get any of them. We'll take Courtois. First centre back isn't great. We'll take Mavropanos. Second centre back is a lot better at 91 rated Nesta. We have quite a few icons. The chemistry shouldn't really be a problem. Pick up another icon here in Vidic as well. In goal we'll take Mike Minan as our keeper. <clears throat> Uh, 
And straight off on the bench, we get a better goalkeeper in Kobo, which is amazing, 94 rated. We do pick up the new DeMarco here. Very nice, 93 rated. He can play left left mid centre-back. We're obviously going to play him centre-back uh, as we already have a left mid. But that card is very flexible, going to be clutch um, for those high rated drafts. You also get Kim Little, which is a big increase to the rating. Nothing doing there. Onto the bench now. We could do it for a few big players. And it starts off with 94 rated Cherky. He wouldn't play. So I think we might as well take the Savio here. 93. Only one rating lower. But can play in the team. Gets us more chemistry as well. Last chance at a high rated attacker. Pick up 94 rated Puskas. We'll play him over the Courtois to complete the chemistry. We are only 92 rated. Next pick, we get 95 rated Rodri. Nice upgrade to the team. We'll play him instead of Little. We are 93 rated. Could really do it for some 97s though. It's not a 97. We get Petit. Isn't actually going to affect the squad really. Would be nice to get a high rated centre back. We don't get a high rated centre. Well, technically we do. But we get 97 rated Frimpong. So we're obviously going to take him and we will play him over Savio. Next up, wow, we get back to back 97 rated players. 97 rated Teo Hernandez. It's very nice to see. Are we going to go up to a 127? Is the question. I don't think we are. Last pick. Seems like it's a big player again. We get 95 Donnarumma. What an end to the draft. Um, it's. Rodri that's missing chemistry. We just need a Spanish manager to get his chem. We will see if we go up to 127. We don't go up to a 94 rated squad, unfortunately. But what a draft that is. I think we can do this to complete our chemistry. 97 Hernandez and 97 Frimpong. What a draft that is. That is an amazing draft. Let's take our manager. And let's get into the next draft attempt. So into the next draft attempt. I'm going to go for the 3 4 2 one formation again. We're going to start this time with a captain pick of 95 rated Zinedine Zidane. Great start to the draft there. Going to get Pedri to go alongside him. Now, our left mid and right mid, as we saw from the last draft attempt, we don't mind if it's not great now because there's so many high rated fullbacks in the game now that um, can get can get the, uh, the right mid and left mid position. As we get 97 rated Messi, which is very nice to see, first 97 of the draft. We don't get 97 Kroof, but we will take his 95 version. Striker, there's so many 97 rated strikers, it's annoying when we don't get any of them. Uh, we get Leo Alexandri, their 93 rate is quite good. We will need a new centre back at some point. Take him for now. And next centre back, gonna be 92 rated Vincent Company. And a big goalkeeper would be nice here. We get Casillas. He's an icon, so chemistry is good. Uh, one more icon and a lot of players' chemistries will be done. So, hop onto the reserves now. Starts off with a 96 rated Puskas. Very nice to see. We do need new left mid, right mid and a new centre back. We get a right mid here in 91 rated David Beckham. Another icon added to the team. Next up, we get a bad pick here. Take Cells. Get Stoichkov here. He can play left mid, so definitely don't mind it. We do need a few high rated players though. We're 93 rated at the moment with a uh, 75 rated centre back. We'll take Swanson. 
onto the bench and it starts off with wow 95 rated Shula is great she's not actually going to play because we have so many high rated attackers already here's our last chance at a high rated attacker and I mean we get Di Maria which is nice for Messi's chemistry but I think we have to go with Golovin here just because he can play left mid gives us another option at left mid so we'll take Golovin Next up is our midfielder pick. Get Rui Costa. Probably not going to play, but we'll take him anyway. Do we see any 97s? We don't see a 97. We get 93 rated Komen here, which is nice. He'll get chemistry. Mane is not going to get chem, so we'll take the Komen. We will play him over Stoichkov. It's not bad. Can we get a big centre back is the question. And we can. We get 93 rated Carlos Alberto added into the team there. Very nice to see. Last chance at a high rated outfield player. We don't get one. And in goal we don't get anything either. So if we order up the bench. What are we looking at? We're 93 again. Uh, to get chemistry I think we can just do this for the chem. We should stay 93. We do stay 93 rated. I do think this is probably the best formation to go with. We can make one more change to see if the rating goes up at all. Unfortunately, it doesn't. It's going to be another 1-2-6. Let's take our manager and let's get into the fourth and final draft attempt. So into the next draft attempt, we are going to take our favourite formation, the 4-3-2-1. We're going to start off with R9 as a captain pick. That is absolutely unbelievable. Oh, I'm not going to take 93 Kroif. I'm going to take 90 Benzema in case we get the 97 Kroif, which we don't. Um, we get Francescoli there. I'm sure we'll see one of the higher rated Kroifs though later in the draft. Um, we'll take 93 rated Modric. And ooh, we get 96 rated Zinedine Zidane. So we're getting the high rated icons which you'd love to see, as well as a 95 rated Onobache. Amazing for the rating. Hopefully we get a big goalkeeper, which we do, a 94 rated Cabell. Oh, Sule would be ideal for chemistry, but we're not going to pass up on Maldini. Can play left back as well if needed. Not going to be needed though, as we get 94 rated Nash and Veng. So we're already 93 rated. We do need a new centre mid. There is the higher rated Cruyff. So glad we didn't take his 93 version. We get Aitana Bonmati. Who I know she's got a 97 card. Two 97 cards in fact. But you don't really see them very often. So we will take her 91 version. We are getting a lot of, a lot of bad picks. Come on EA. Oh that's not great. Look at that, our bench is full of gold players. So, we are due some big picks and Phil Foden is not it. This is our last chance at a high rated attacker. We do get 94 rated uh, Di Maria. We're yet to see a 97 in this draft. We pick up 96 rated Carolyn Nicoli. And you know what, she can play up front. And R9 goes to Cam. We are, if this is a 1-2-7 believe it or not um doesn't feel like it i'll be honest but we are 94 rated we now pick up 96 rated vatinia now i'm not sure how he's going to get chemistry but we are going to take him anyway we could really do with another icon as we get 90 oh wow 97 rated frimpong next you know what? he's actually going to help with chemistry plus one to our chem there we're still 94 rated. We now pick up 94 rated Basha. Who doesn't really help with Kem, but the fact that she's 94 rated is great for us. Last chance at a high rated player. It's going to be our goalkeeper. We get 85 rated Zentna. And this is still a 94 rated draft. We just need to figure out the Kem. That is crazy to me. That is absolutely mental that this is a... Uh, 
a 94 rated draft. The problem we have, does it go to 95? No, it doesn't go to 95. The problem that we do have is our goalkeeper doesn't get chem. And two of our midfielders don't get chem. We can do this. We're still 94 rated. The problem I have is the Vettinho. I just don't see how he gets chem. If I was to do something crazy like this, we definitely drop down to a 93 rating. So guys, I don't think there's a way of us getting the chemistry. Leave a comment down below if you think there's a way to do it. We are going to take our manager and see how close we get. Now we do get a uh, Switzerland manager. So that helps out Kobel's chemistry. But the Vettini is still an issue. So we'll take him as our manager. It is 94 rated. Guys, if you enjoyed the video, leave a like, subscribe to the channel if you are new, and until next time.